Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The National Security Minister Peter Bunting has reacted to calls by his opposition counterpart to send the army into the war-torn communities of Dunkirk following the murder of a baby and a man. According to Mr. Bunting, Dunkirk requires more like a cultural change at the community level to control crime. In the Vibes Cartel murder trial, a handwriting expert for the defense has testified that he does not remember a court case in which he appeared years ago where it was said that his analysis lacked proof. Last week, the expert, Carl Major, gave evidence contradicting statements from the key witness in the case regarding a letter allegedly written to the public defender. The Guys Hill High School in St. Catherine reopened today after a week-long closure because of a noxious chemical that affected the school and its surroundings. It has been reported that the fumes came from a garbage truck on Sunday, February 9. St. Anne Justice of the Peace Norma Roden Walters is to be sworn in as the Custos of St. Anne on March 13. She will assume the responsibility following the retirement of her husband, Ratcliffe Walters. In sports, Jamaica's two-man bobsleigh team of driver Winston Watts and brakesman Marvin Dixon failed to get into the crucial fourth round of competition after another poor run at the Winter Olympics in Sochi, Russia. After occupying the bottom position following the first two runs on Sunday, the pair completed round three in 58.17 seconds to finish 29th out of 30 crews. In your weather forecast, Tuesday morning will be partly cloudy. During the afternoon, expect scattered showers mainly over central and western parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.